Hello and welcome back to Dark Souls. If you're truly really loaded into the mad. Now, as previously we fell down to our doom, we know how to make our way back there and uh, not fall down to our doom. Sounds easy in stretch, you know, tactics, right? Yeah. How did you. You busted. You're inside the floor, you shouldn't be able to attack me from inside the floor. Not to say I shouldn't be able to attack you through the floor. I mean, it's, it's really silly. How the hitboxing works in this game. Alright, one, two, three, four, five. There we go. Okay, I, now I need to regain my stamina so I can one, two, three, four this guy as well. One, run. Oh, never mind. Drink up, I think. Yeah, that sounds about right. Sprint. Run. I'll get knocked about. One. Get knocked about. One. No combo there. Do that in it there. Which actually isn't for crystal. Crystal uses normal. That right. Blue is used for... I don't remember anymore. <laughs> Crystal and Lightning both use normal ones, if I remember correctly. While... Hmm. Can't recall. There's other things that use the other ones. Long story short. I think it was... Enchanted and magic that used blue, but I'm still not that uncertain because I don't really remember. Did I hit him? Probably not. Hey, Rudman. Why so rude, Rudman? Stop being so rude, Rudman. Uh, and now we need to hope that we don't fall down before we get to our retrieval. It doesn't sound that challenging, but uh, trust me. It might be just that challenging. Because this guy has a knockback. Wait, 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 I'll drink. Thanks. Ah, I wasn't sprinting, wasn't my line, no. Get that. This is right. So there is that. And I almost spinned too far. Uh something to mention. Uh excessive Dodging in this area is bad for one's health, so yeah, I should probably look into that. And when I say bad for one's health, I mean that it can kill me. No, go away, Sparklies, you are no longer meaningful. That's my retrieval over there, so that's what I need to reach. Between here and there, there are no enemies, just a large chasm, a large bottomless. Without the bottom, which is, of course, something to keep in mind when crossing large bottomless pits. Um, it shouldn't be that way, it's just that way, right? No tricks, no tricks. Ah. Yes! Him falling down did mean he died. Excellent. Now I just need to kill one more of those things. Also, wasn't there another buff somewhere around here? I think that was a loot debuff. So it's not really all that relevant, but uh. Oh, shite. Oh! Hello! Did I get one? I got one, but uh, I 
Gik og miste der, man. Oop. Well, this the... Pretty rough. I don't want to take. And this is a corpse. So that's cute. Hmm. Hmm. And the thing is, I never learned how to drop from here. Safely. So, there has to be a way. You're not meant to fall to death in every scenario in this game. This, that's my perceived understanding of the game's rules. Hmm. Alright, and I fall down. Boop. Uh, I am tempted to use some fire ops for that one because he is... Uh, right up in my bum bum see right up there congratulations you have to prove yourself worthy of dying by fire or well partially by fire Some burns before being cut apart. Cutting apart crystals is easy. Let me tell you. Not that there is much of a reason to tell you, but you know. If you give me the permission, I'll tell you. Cutting crystal isn't easy. Even with the great sword of Victorious. I don't remember what they were most easily damaged by when it comes to the melee weapons melee weapon damage types okay, I think I need to go that way that should keep me alive yeah, I stayed alive good now there's still that one lizard I missed last time so I should be able to get that as well once while I'm here Oh, apparently I missed two. Oh, they only got one this time as well. All right, but something to keep in mind, I guess. Also, don't fall the fuck down. That sounds like a terrible idea. Also, if you want homeward bone out of here, I could just upgrade my flame again. Uh, but that doesn't sound like an option, and I don't think we can walk out of here. Actually, we can. That path over there does lead back to the previous one. But it's risky. It's really risky. I wish I could just... Use that as a platform. Alright. Is this it? This is a convenient area. Would be made more convenient if I didn't fuck it up. Alright. Great fireball. Drink. Yeah, this isn't working, is it? No. I can't take him down either. And now my retrieval is in a much more difficult place. So, congratulations to me. Yeah. Holy shit, this went poorly. I might lose my humanity by losing my, my retrieval. We'll see. It might happen. Ugh, I prefer it if it didn't. Oh, we still have a chance. Yeah, there we go. That's... We're still alive. <sighs> yeah. Okay, I guess I'm gonna invite you in on my journey back to the crystal forest. Could I walk?
I don't know, I've already taunted the enemy. So how do you want to play, hey? You want to jump into a tree. That's cool. Then you want to do the crystal thing. That's that's cool. Though it's it looks cool, but you know, practically it's kinda very hazardous to my health. Oh. Except the uh, hazard to my health part again. Sheesh, almost died there. But luckily we did not. So it could have gone much worse than it did. Alright. What did we deem? Did we deem him worthy of a few fire orbs? I think we did. You bloody bastard, you just basically dodged. Wait. That worked. I was actually planning on falling onto him when he was still below me, but then I... Then he moved. The bastard. The bloody bastard. Hmm. I may still be considering the plan of... Uh, just... Getting the retrieval and running home. But the firing shrine. On the other hand, my retrieval is way over there, so it isn't as likely to happen. Alright. Most dangerous part about this path is the fact that it's invisible. Stating the obvious, since who knows when? Since forever. Since, was, since before the world was created. Yeah. Ah, uh, I think he just got up under the ground. At least I think he was there. I'm not actually convinced. Hmm. This is the worst. I think if I jump onto the corpse, I don't die instantly. That's right. I did not die instantly, but I will die in a second. So why did, did I even retrieve him? Who knows? Bye! Follow me! Please follow me! Please follow me! Alrighty then, how should I do this? I do have enough souls now that I maybe should just do this. But, on the other hand, I really want this fellow dead. Hmm. No! That was not what I was meant to do. That was not at all what I was meant to do. God damn it. I would probably be a lot less annoyed if it wasn't for the long commute to the job. Oh well. Especially since it's partially risky. They just tried to kick. I think I just tried to kick. Uh, I wish I knew actually how to actually reliably do it instead of just doing it an accident when I mean to swing my sword. It's probably something like that movement and then strike. Probably. Ah, shake. Hmm. This guy's almost dead, so. It's not too problematic, but. I'm still hoping to manage it without being harmed. Well, at least this guy was as useless as I had hoped. Uh, but now. We return to the Crystal Forest, wherein we will once again face that annoying bugger and then the golden bugger. The golden bugger, I'm not sure I know how to kill. Wait, can I lock onto him yet? No, I can. 
I didn't want to do that. I wanted to spin the fuck out. Like the fuck out. This also worked. You know, it's not what I had in mind. Well, actually, I didn't need to spin the fuck out. I meant jump up and smash my sword into his head. Because that is a pretty reliable technique for killing shite. From my experience, anyway. Hmm. I wonder, how many arrows do we have? Um... 214. No, don't... Just... Oh, fine. Now we have less. Than 214. Good. Good. Not really good at all. Yeah, okay. This shouldn't leave us here again, which is a safe place where nothing can harm us until we drop onto that guy, in which case it's more likely for the environment to harm us than the bugger himself. Ah, the worst thing is, well I know there is a buff here, it's a bit zigzaggy, I think the reward was a blue titanite slab, which I honestly I'm not too interested in. Alright. It would be nice if you could just move below me. I forgot to check if I could hit him with a bow from up there. Oh. Wait, where was I anyway? I don't think I actually had the sights on him for that. The angle. Oh well. You. This time. The important thing is for me to not to fall down. That's the wrong ability. This is the right ability. I think we've got this. Bit of an unorthodox method, maybe, but yeah, we had this. <sighs> this goes back, I believe. So let's not do that. That won't be useful. Where is the way onwards, though? There are flakes. There should be flakes somewhere to the left of us as well. I only see them on the right. Where is the path? Is it saying this is the wrong way? Well, that certainly is the wrong way. God damn it. Not again. I really wish I knew how wide those invisible uh, pathways were. So I'd know when it's actually safe to maneuver them. Get it! Get it! Yes! He's dead. He's dead now. Yeah. If nothing else, we actually managed to get those this episode. It's mostly a case of nothing else there. All on the corpse. Don't dead. Good. Get your retrieval. Good. Look around in confusion. What the hell am I supposed to do now? Is this something? There's a message that says here. No, is it the safe way to here? It was. But then where? There? Not there. God damn it. Well, we made some sort of progress this episode, so thanks for watching. <laughs>
I'll see you next time. Geronimo! How does that make you feel, eh? Eh? Makes you feel like singing, eh? La 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 la